Anyone who's ever been poolside and slatted on sunscreen can relate to the term SPF, or Sun Protection Factor. An SPF number lets you know how effective the sunscreen will be. The higher the number, the more effective it is. According to the American Academy of Dermatology, dermatologists recommend using a sunscreen with an SPF of at least 30 to block 97% of the sun's UVB rays. So, Let's translate this to window film. This gets a little scientific, but I'm going to point out the really important parts. SPF is a measure from 280 nanometers to 400 nanometers of how much ultraviolet light is transmitted. A basic way to calculate the SPF of a product is to divide 100 by the ultraviolet transmissions. For example, 100 divided by 0.5 transmissions equals 200 SPF. This isn't exactly accurate as SPF goes up to 400 nanometers, but it provides an estimate. Every Matico film has a different SPF reading, since each film is slightly different up to 400 nanometers. For example, a clear film, such as Clear 800, would have an SPF of 236, while a film with a lower VLT, like Starlight 8, would be 2723. A film such as UV Guard, which is designed for UV protection, has an SPF of 1,937, since it blocks further into the visible spectrum than a CL800 type of film. Those are some pretty huge numbers compared to that 30 SPF you put on yourself. Suffice it to say, if you're indoors, in a building protected with window films like these, you'll have it made in the shade with Matico.